Welcome to Dry Run. Now, most likely you're gonna to wanna to import your data from your accounting software or CRM, but in Dry Run, you can also adjust things and add things manually. And that's where we're gonna get started. So that you can understand how Dry Run is organized, we're going to add three items manually. First, we'll add an invoice of money owed to you in the cash in section. Next, we'll add a bill into the cash out section. And finally, an expense in the recurring section. Simply click on add item in the cash in section to add your first invoice. This is a great place to keep track of everything that's owed to you and when you're likely to be paid. Next, click on cash out to expand that section. Here we can add one of those large one off bills that you need to pay attention to to make sure that they're paid on time. And finally, let's add an expense to the recurring section. This is a great place to put those regular repeating expenses so that you have a really good idea how much it costs for you to stay in business every single month. Now all of those transactions are reflected on the graph and you can see exactly how long your cash will last. Now you can continue to use dry run manually or you can import your data. Simply click on the import data button next to the scenario title and the dry run wizard will start up and walk you through the process of getting your data into dry run and organize exactly the way you need it.